True prayer is to surrender your knowledge, your intelligence, your crooked and cunning ways of doing things. It is to surrender your doubts in exchange for an insight into God's mind. One revelation from God can carry you through for the rest of your life. God has a heart towards every situation, every matter or dilemma that has ever existed and that will ever exist. There is no blind spot with him. Every angle is covered. So you see friends, it is a privilege really to be able to have access to the one who holds the answer to you all. Those that say the Bible contradicts itself or that there are grey areas in the Bible have not fully committed to seek the heart of God in the matter they query. For nothing is hidden that will not be made manifest, nor is anything secret that will not be made known and come to light. Luke 8, 17. It is the glory of God to conceal things, but the glory of kings is to search things out. Proverbs 25, verse 2. The friendship of the Lord is for those who fear him, and he makes known to them his covenant. Psalms 25, verse 14. So, my dear friends, you see, it is the Lord's desire to make secret things known to you, just as it is also his desire to give you answers to your prayers and solutions to your problems. That is why we must pray. No matter how heavy or urgent the situation may be, lift it up to God in prayer, and it will surely come through in time. When you don't pray, it means you are proud and you think you know better than God. So let us pray now. Dear Lord, I ask that you bless the heart of those who read this today. I ask that you cause them to see the many reasons why you have given us the privilege to communicate with you through prayer. I ask that you help us all to understand that there is no prayer that is in vain and that every time we pray, there is a change. Something shifts to our advantage. Lord, I pray that you quench every pride that is sitting on our tongues and causing us not to pray. Break every stronghold that causes us to see prayer as chores instead of the privilege and honour that it actually is. This I pray in your name. Amen.